new unit, baby. Welcome to a week in my life as a full-time appliance reseller. It is the end of the week, it is now Friday, but we made some big sales that allowed us to expand the business. Brand new unit, 25 by 10. Our old unit was 10 by 10. We have so much more room for more inventory. Let's rewind back to Monday and I'll show you the sale that allowed us to go on and expand this business to what it is just four days later. Okay, right now I am leaving the climbing gym and I am on my way to the storage unit to go potentially make $2,100 profit on one of those Viking ranges I made a video about two weeks ago. Let's go see if I sell it. Okay, so we have about an hour until the guy is here to see the Viking ranges. I have two of the exact same model. He gets his pick of the litter. He gets to decide which one he wants. This is a listing that I posted on Facebook Marketplace. So he is here to see it. He's driving about 40 minutes away. He'll be here in an hour. Hopefully we can close that deal. To recap what happened on Friday, this guy showed up and he was like, hey, I might want both your ranges. So I'm like, okay, let's do it. He left with both of the ranges. Again, I paid $800 for him. He Venmoed me 4,600 bucks for these two ranges. Then it leaves us with a total profit of just under $3,700. We'll take into account $40 for trailer rental. We'll call it $100 for storage fees, even though it's a little bit less than that. But for two weeks, maybe five hours of work, cleaning them up, listing them, picking them up, selling them, $3,600, you're kidding. That's $500 an hour for flipping appliances on Facebook Marketplace. What's up, party people? Happy Tuesday. Right now, I'm on my way to my storage unit and to meet an appliance technician. He is going to switch my 48-inch Wolf range from propane to natural gas. Why? Because I sold it. And I have to deliver it tomorrow but before i have to deliver it the lady wants it to be natural gas so we're switching it from propane to natural gas the part cost me 60 dollars. the labor is going to cost me 250 dollars, but it'll be all worth it so guy shows up to convert the range from propane to natural gas like i said part was 60 dollars. labor was 250 now we're into that range for about 1400 dollars here we are again in the car. Today is Wednesday. Yesterday we got the natural gas converted in the woof. That was good. I'm in communication with the buyer for it who lives five hours away. Me and Chad are going to go drive it out sometime later this week. But Wednesday, I got a new bike. So I'm going to go for a bike ride. And two, I am also picking up a 48 inch woof cooktop. I got this lead from one of my Facebook Marketplace listings for my Wolf Ranges. The guy saw me, he was like, hey, I saw you have Wolf Ranges listed on Facebook. You have multiple of them. Do you buy them? I'm like, yes, absolutely. Let's see what you got and I will show you. Okay, so on Wednesday, what did I do? Like I said, I picked up that Wolf cooktop. Here it is, Wolf R4864CG is the model number. I paid $400 for it. There is a sold comp on eBay for $3,000. Pro tip from this, if you're cross posting between eBay and Facebook Marketplace, put in your descriptions on Facebook that you also buy like-minded things. For me, I sell appliances. So in my Facebook Marketplace descriptions, I say I also buy appliances. Say you sell iPhones. If you're listing them again back on Facebook Marketplace, list that you also buy iPhones. Could be a good source of leads for you to get new clientele and new inventory. Okay, today is now Thursday and we have another deal coming. I have $1,000 in this envelope and I'm picking up a soft serve ice cream machine. This will be my first time selling soft serve equipment. I think it's a fantastic market that all of you can tap into. Buying local soft serve machines, listing them on eBay and shipping them freight via U-Ship. That's all I do. But let's go check it out. Okay, we got both the Wolf and the Taylor ice cream machine back to the storage unit. All we gotta do is clean them up and list them. Between these two, we got $400 into the Wolf. I'm listing it for $3,000. We got 
$1,000 into the Taylor machine back there, I'm listing it for $4,000. So $1,400 purchase price, $7,000 in listed value. After fees and shipping, we're looking at profiting about $4,000 between these two items right here. Okay, and here we are. It is again Friday, end of the week. Now, going back to that Wolf 48 inch range, did I end up selling it? Yes, I did. I sold it for a total of 45, so 4560 all in together. Attached are the screenshots for proof. She sent me a $500 deposit plus the extra $4,000 at the end. So this week, revenue, we made $9,100. Yep, a lot of money for just three appliances, literally three appliances, but that doesn't count purchase price. Purchase price with all of them, we'll call it $1,800. After storage fees, maintenance costs, we'll call it another $600, trailer rental $100. So we're all in 2,500 bucks pretty solid week if you asked me now what we still have to do this wolf range is still in the unit so we need to get shipped out it is a five hour drive if we cannot find a carrier who wants to do it because it is really big and we don't have a forklift or a lift gate we will do it ourselves but i believe through the power of you ship i will find a carrier who wants to ship it now for you if you're still watching this video you must care about making money on Facebook Marketplace and on eBay. I have a school community to join. It's $19 a month. Everyone who has joined so far has made money. We have all found deals for everybody. Everyone is in it together. What we do, weekly meetings with me, one-on-one. -on -one. Also, weekly meetings with the whole community. And the community posts what they're buying to flip. So, consider that. But the new business model is working wonders, like I said, over $6,000 profit just from five days of sales. Stay tuned for next week.